I'm Steve Jamison with Coach John Wooden, and this is our new book, The Essential Wooden, which is a sequel to the best-selling Wooden on Leadership. Uh, Coach Wooden, what are some of your essentials necessary for great leadership? Well, there are many uh, things that a great leader must have, but first of all, I think you must make the followers understand they're working with you. They must feel they're working with you, not for you, and then I think they'll do a much better job. And to do this, you must listen to your followers. It's very important. If you expect them to listen to you, you must listen to them. I'm often asked my opinion of Bobby Knight. And uh, I think the reason for that is that our personalities are different. And uh, I have those who think that they can start a little controversy with what I have to say. But, you know, I think Bobby Knight is one of the finest coaches and teachers that the game has had. His method is different, just as uh, General Patton's uh, method was different from, say, uh, uh, many of the other generals. But they got the job done, and that's the important thing. You know, Bobby Knight, practically all of his players graduated. And isn't a college coach responsible for that? I think just as much as anything else. I think he's a tremendous coach. Our, our methods just happen to be different, which, in my opinion, doesn't make his right and mine wrong or vice versa. Anyone in position of leadership is going to have a lot of different uh, problems with, with which to deal because those under the supervision are all different. They're going to have different problems. I relate somewhat uh, with Bill Walton, one of the great players who played for me, one of the greatest players of all time. And uh, he felt that I didn't have the right to tell him how to uh, wear his hair. I felt it was important that uh, players uh, not wear their hair too long or wear, uh, uh, you know, sideburns or mutton chops or things of that sort because I felt there was a reason for it. It caused excessive uh, uh, sweat, and that goes down. It can get on their hands or get in their eyes. But after one great season, his first season with me, as a matter of fact, Bill Walton was player of the year. We had, won an undefe we had an undefeated national championship. And the next year he came to me, and he wanted to wear his hair longer and wear uh, perhaps a beard. And he said, I did not have the right to determine that. And I said, you're absolutely right, Bill. I don't have the right to tell you how to wear your hair. But I do have the right to determine who's going to play, and we're going to miss you. Well, I knew Bill, and I knew he was sort of testing me, and that was all right. You mustn't get upset when those under you supervision test you. Listen to them. But you must have uh, certain rules that you must stand by, and you must be consistent with them. The Essential Wooden, brand new from John Wooden. 200 tips, ideas, and concepts on leadership as practiced by one of the great coaches of the 20th century, the essential wooden.